Lazarus was sick. Things didn't look good. His sisters were trying whatever they could, but their brother was dying and close to the end. So they sent word for Jesus, for he was their friend. They knew he could help and they knew he could heal and they needed him now, for this problem was real. But on hearing the news, Jesus stayed where he was. This sickness, he said, will bring glory to God. And he didn't set off until later that week. I'll go there and wake him. Our friend is asleep. That's fine then, his friend said, relieved at the news, since surely some sleeping would help him improve. But Jesus said no, that was not what he meant. Their friend was not sleeping, but already dead. They were shocked and confused as they set out to leave. This has happened, said Jesus, so you might believe. Now four days had passed since they'd sealed off the tomb, and the sisters were heavy with sadness and gloom. Lord, Martha bawled, seeing Jesus draw near. He'd still be alive if you'd only been here. Your brother, said Jesus, will rise once again. And quite what he meant she could not comprehend. But the next words he spoke gave her hope in her strife. I am the resurrection and I am the life. Believing in me and the life that I'm giving means not even dying can stop you from living. You are God's son, Martha cried in belief, overflowing with joy in the midst of her grief. But her sister met Jesus with eyes full of tears. Lord, he would not have died if you had been here. And although Jesus knew that new life was so near, when he got to the tomb, Jesus broke down in tears. But then he stood up and he started to pray and seeing the stone ordered, roll it away. The smell will be awful, they started to shout. But Jesus commanded, Lazarus, come out. Holding their breath, people watched on in fear as a bandaged up man soon began to appear. Walking and talking, completely revived. Lazarus, their brother, was really alive. And with fresh tears of joy, they all wept and they whooped at the wonderful things that King Jesus could do. And one day they'd see Jesus breathe his last breath and they'd see him come back, the defeater of death. And we see a Jesus who weeps because he cares. And when we're feeling sad, we know he has been there. King Jesus who came to beat sadness and strife. For he is the resurrection and he is the life.